Okay, obviously, we're doing a lot of things. You know, Psychic Media Services, Zorgatron Media, Awesome Cast, Wrestling Mayhem Show. And we need to, I, 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 I was recognizing the need that we need to um, um, organize a little bit more because I realized I was talking about all these things over on, I, I, chill, I was just talking with him beforehand. I, I usually coordinate with him if he's going to be in studio over a direct message on Twitter. Mm-hmm. Yet Katie, who I have on regularly, uh, I'm doing it in messages or or in fa- or email sometimes, right? Uh, and 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 you know, uh, Mike, you know, we were doing you know wrestling mayhem show. I was trying to do, use a Facebook chat for that for a little mm-hmm. bit. We try to coordinate something happening over this past weekend over there. And and one gifts get a little out of control. Can we can we agree on that? <laughs> a little bit. Um. Yeah. The fact that you can literally just click and add things kind of dilutes the conversation. So to, so to speak mm-hmm. a little bit but yeah. until the point where i'm worried that like the the important information is kind of getting lost in in the tomfoolery that's happening um and i keep hearing about this thing called slack uh on a lot of my productivity podcasts on tech podcasts so the businesses are using them right and, and i remember when i had the the, the nine to fiver like we did all of our communication in our office communication on aol instant messenger so not quite as secure or anything like that. What's happening over there? Um, so Chilla found a way to put gifts on Slack. Oh, no. <laughs> All right. Well, gifts are not the primary reason that we would have a problem. It's like as you were saying it, he was looking through different categories. And, like, and, like, oh, I wonder if I can just drag this down here. And yeah, a very appropriate <laughs> She's a very appropriate uh, <laughs> gift as well over there. Uh, thanks, Chilla. Thanks for that. Well, and it was funny because actually what got me started, uh, let's finish the Slack thing and then I'll digress into animated gifts. Okay. So so let's continue. Sorry, oh. I didn't mean I didn't mean to for, like move us past Slack because I'm loving Slack. Mm-hmm. But I could definitely now see myself a lot of gifts in there let's keep that in the general uh okay so here's what we've done here if you're on video you can kind of see our organization at least like the the initial what i'm trying to do here like i really just kind of went in and listed all the kind of properties we're working with the the websites the uh the events the the podcast and 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 inviting people in and uh again if you're familiar with twitter and how facebook works it's really you it really get it right off the bat right at replies work hashtags. If you use a hashtag for these uh, channels in here, like uh, we have a hashtag for awesome cast. If I type it in here, that is now clickable. And now here's your awesome cast stuff. Now, if you, here was one, one thing I was wondering is, <clears throat> so I know I can create a channel, a new channel mm-hmm. and I can make it public or I can make it private and I can invite others or whatever. If I hashtag a channel that doesn't exist, does it auto create the channel? I'm going to try it. Hashtag fun with gifts. <laughs> <laughs> and we go to general and... Uh, no, nah, it does not occur. No, no, no. It has to be something that... It has it, to be something that exists. So it, that's good. But that's a good thing, right? Right, right. Because uh, how many channels will we freaking have in here? <laughs> but but it's nice because... And again, you all, you don't see all the channels like that I have over here. You see the channels that you belong to. So you see awesome cast. You see general. You see random. Because I think general and random, uh, everybody belongs to. That's kind of the... It's the courtyard. It's the it's it's that kind of stuff, um, and and then we can bury it down. And say okay, let's have the conversation over here about awesome cast. Let's have the conversation over here about what we're going to do for Chachi plays. Even to a certain point, I, I just dropped in ideas I have for Chachi plays. Now, why is this different? Why is this different than just using uh, Facebook Messenger? Well, now it's searchable, and it is free. Um, and I believe that it keeps your last 10,000 messages or something like that if it's free. Wow. So you do have to, if, if you're, if we have a bunch of people in here, we might have to start paying for it just to make sure we retain everything. There's, there's extra features and privacy that you can get into. But if you're a small group that just needs to organize like an event or something, or you have a couple projects, uh, uh together, um, this is going to be really nice for free to try this out. Has apps on everything. There's even there's a Windows app. There's a Windows Phone app. I think um, there's a Mac Store app, like you were talking mm-hmm. about getting. Uh, so I, I just downloaded that, and it, it it works. It's interesting to see the parallels, but it, it does the the UI is obviously tailored to the device you're using. Mm-hmm. So keep that in mind. I think everything's there on every device. It's just where it's at. 
is a little bit different. Right, right. It takes a little bit of getting used to. I think you're going to get that. I, you're going to get that, though. Um, well, then I've noticed, because I threw it on uh, uh, my Windows 10 device as well, and um, and I think it, it's pretty comparable when you look at these. So, uh, but yeah, here's all the Wrestling Mayhem Show stuff. We haven't really gotten too deep in any conversation that I'm worried about. And then Chill's sharing uh, uh, interesting pictures with me and he's making <laughs> where he's Tony Stark and, uh, you know, stuff like that. But also the integration. I can't remember where I put it. I think it was in general. Uh, maybe it was Mayhem Show. But uh, but there's integration for stuff like, you know, I just, you, for uh, Dropbox, for Google Drive, you know, brings you right into uh, you, you know, your stuff there. And there's the, 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 the services that it lists are plentiful. I haven't heard of half of this stuff. So if you configure your integrations, which is apparently on the site itself, we'll pop that up. Um, yeah, again, I don't know what half of this stuff is, to be honest. Um, uh, you know, Airbrake, App Signal, Blossom. Um, a lot of these are, are like for video meetings and devices. Um, I, I noticed uh, on, on Google Hangouts, it says you can actually bring your conversations like so you can have a clickable into a Google Hangout on here, which, um, Mike, that might be helpful for when yeah. you're doing Google Hangout shows. Okay. Um, so, I mean, you know, again, just putting the link in there will we'll take you to it, too. Um, that, that'd even be nice for AwesomeCast to kick off the show in that way instead of having to call everybody. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. just put a link in there and say hey click in when you're ready yeah if it, but i don't know but do we want every guest in here as well is the other question that's true well i would have say here's the link for everybody once we have everyone in then you would call the guest that's true too tap true guest too. in i don't know it's just an idea yeah and it's the other like what is the use case here and you can't we can't do private channels because there's some things you know talking with the business i might not want everybody to be able to find in mm-hmm. there you know so we can privatize that a little bit too if we're talking about like financials or something something like that that i don't want to talk about for real um you know it's it's it it seems like it, it gets most of the stuff done so my other thing is i want to integrate this a little bit more and um um i, I want to uh, and by the way chachi just quit because uh because you put an anime gif in here by the way <laughs> he quits everything because i, was gonna I say, do chachi something. quits at least three times a it week. was a test i didn't it's not like i it's not like I kept. I can. I can continue to drag more, more in. <laughs> here, here, here we go, Chachi. This one's for you. <laughs> but, uh, but no, I think it's a nice little. Um, it, it, it's a nice inter-office communication thing. What is this? What am I looking at here? It's um, not even. Is oh, a, now, a, now you have to. Now you have to. GIF. You have to actually uh, click on it in order for it to GIF though. So that's kind of nice. Oh, and you can actually go through all the pictures in there. So that's kind of nice. Sad to see Chachi go. <laughs> um, well, there you go. You see, you see what trouble you can get into. But again, and then it's also it's not in Facebook. If you're worried about putting things in Facebook, now who's Slack? I, I you can read into it. I think they have more privacy in general and better policies. Um, everybody seems to be using it on a business level, so there must be a bit of a familiarity with it. This is the kind of thing that when you talk about Facebook business, they're trying to compete with. Yeah. is this kind of system for business so um so again we're only a couple days into it we'll see how it goes uh, <laughs> chachi's already out apparently um yeah i wonder if every time <laughs> i mention chachi says if he gets an alert on his phone yes probably but you know what if chachi quits something you know it has to be pretty viable because he <laughs> I mean, you know, he he generally always comes back to the stuff that he quits, so it sticks around. That's true. That's true. That's true. Uh, 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 I mean, look, he went back to Plurk. He went back to Plurk. He went back to NXT. Back to Plurk. Went back to NXT. See, he has an iPhone, but work made him. Um, he has a Mac. I gave him the Mac. <laughs> he went back to Xbox. Oh, One. see, he's already back. See. <laughs> All right. Other We're than going this back thing. on the grid. But also, <laughs> also really nice is is we have our own domain. So it's like, hey, if you want to get on this, like it's sorgatronmedia.slack.com. And I wonder what happens if you're not on there. I think it does it ask for a login. And I think you you can only let certain people. Oh, and this is nice because I invited somebody and I used their work email. And it's a domain like you know complete blah blah bank dot com, right? And I'll notice that it's not like Gmail or something. So if I set everybody up with a sorgatronmedia.com email address, I can say whitelist anybody from this address. That's nice. Because obviously if they have a sorgatronmedia.com or this other company, and I say, well, anybody from that company, I want a part of this. 
And now you don't have to worry about that. And it's wide open to them. So um, so that's if you're you know using your own email uh, versus uh, Gmail, Yahoo, something like that. So it's worth checking out. Um, I don't know. You, have, you guys have any other thoughts on it a little bit, that we'll, we'll Chilla, that you've used it so far? I'm really, really enjoying it. To me, bringing the, the, the group together is more of a community. Right. This, right. This, it, it just makes, to me, perfect sense. And that's the thing. I want to bring this whole, like, all of us collaborating into one place. I was trying to do this with Coffee Club. Yeah. <laughs> you know, <laughs> now we can kind of do this as, as, as a whole for the most I still, part. don't get me wrong, I still like the idea for Coffee Club and actually yeah. getting together. Which I'm what, actually looking to bring that back, by the way. I, I like this because I can check in on it through the day or once a day or mm -hmm. once every other day but if someone mentions me i get an alert right i can kind of get alerted just on certain channels like i can kind of customize it for my need the other thing that i really like about this was is i noticed as soon as i signed in and said send me send me notifications on my phone i got an email that said phone notifications have been enabled emails have been disabled so i'm not inundated nice i am not inundated on every platform that someone posted something in a different section you know what i mean yeah. I, and that's what drives me nuts about facebook yeah because it's mm -hmm. like i get a notification on my phone then i get an email that i got a message like it i get it 52 different ways and times across all the devices and the, all the email boxes and everything else that i i really enjoyed i'm like wow slack got it like I only need to be notified once. I, mm -hmm. I don't need to be inundated. It also seems like it'd be good for like multitasking and like integrating over the different shows, like just in case someone from the Mayhem show decides to be on Awesome Cast, <laughs> or someone from Awesome Cast is on Mayhem show or Boss. Right, right. And you can drop show. in, and, and I don't know. Is it is it easy to leave channels as well? I would imagine. Uh, so like like Mike, if you're on Awesome Cast, you can drop into that and see what we've been talking about lately around the show. And, and know what's going on there and then just kind of oh, okay i'm done now, now i don't think i can because i'm kind of like the master user on here mm -hmm. uh, you can leave so the channel you can leave the channel so then <coughs> and that, that that means like you won't get updates anymore from that right. channel where i like about like about it too is, is if someone wants to drop into awesome cousin and say hey i saw this article thought you guys might be interested or or boss battle i may see someone for video games and say just drop in a link and say hey i don't know if you guys were going to talk about this but i thought this was pretty cool mm -hmm. so i feel like it helps generate additional content that others may not have seen right right and, and even you know, a little bit of um uh, and say not just for podcasts like i said we're, we're going to try to use it for the collaboration there's a documentary we're trying to work on and i actually had been talking with one person i was trying to get me some contacts with people and now i'm working with somebody else that's that's been helping me on, on another aspect of it and i realized i hadn't gotten those two people together yet to talk about the documentary so i invited them both in and threw them on a channel on here and it's like well let's see what happens so um, and, and, and I, especially since they're both in very different, but similar in, in industries, I'm hoping to see them kind of gel a little bit. Um, so I, I think it'll be, it'll be nice in general.